And yesterday, I spent some time at Presque Isle with Mark Quest, a fresh local group in the area that's bringing LARPing to the Upper Peninsula. And here's what it's all about. Hey, you guys. I'm Jacob Darner, and I'm in Marquette on Presque Isle, where the folks at Mark Quest LARP are having one of their last big meetups before their battle at the end of the month. And if you're wondering why I'm a little sweaty, it's because I've been trying my hand at combat and seeing just what goes into live action role playing. LARPing is short for live action role playing. Um, it takes on a lot of different forms, but uh, for our organization, it's really heavily focused around medieval style combat. Um, there's a lot of other elements to it as far as questing, just the merriment of eating, drinking, music, um, and character interactions with one another, but it is largely hinged on, hinged on the combat. So. It was just something that like, as you get into role play of any kind, you start to see the whole world of role play that exists, learning about these LARP experiences that they've been to, um, and then just being super excited to increase like any type of role play fun in my life. For the event, we want to have kind of a little bit of everything. Um, we want to we have like crafts, kind of like an artisan set up for people to kind of just tinker around. Um, we have a bunch of side quests that people can go on. Um, a tavern with uh, caterers and refreshments. And then the full scale battle is the main event of the day. We've got three different factions. so. Um, basically people who buy tickets can pick which faction suits them the best and then they sort of don their own character. They come up with their own name and their own little background story that fits in the lore we have on the website. Um, so uh, we have our three factions are um, the Enclave of Blood and Stone, the Order of the Gilded Sun, um, and the House of the Silver Barb, which is our healing healers faction. Yeah, character development is a huge part of it, and we've built a ton of lore that people can look at on our website. So we've built a world, Pharos, we have a map that we have some maps here and we bring to our events that people can look at and on the website. Like ourselves, um, in the game, I'm Commander Illusion, and that's who I will be the entire weekend that we're there. Right. Um, and everybody else, we hope, will build a character with a backstory that they can come in and um, not have to be themselves for the entire time that they're there. It's the yeah. ultimate vacation. Mm -hmm. We haven't quite released the exact um, address of the event yet, but it's in Halfway Village, Michigan, so it's about 20 minutes north of Marquette up 550. Mm -hmm. um, and when uh, we'll be giving the address to everybody that buys tickets through um, emails that we have people listed for. Um, and it's September 23rd, um, that entire day. Yep, the check-in starts at 10 a.m. and then it goes till 11 p.m. So yeah. early check-in would like let you come in on Friday instead of Saturday yep. and put yep. up your tent and set up and then hang out with us. And, mm -hmm. and tickets are available on our website, markwestlarp.com. Um, but you can also find all this information on our social media, uh, which is our, also markwestlarp uh, on Instagram and on Facebook. So. And um, yeah. if you have Discord, uh, we have a growing Discord community that's pretty fun. To be yeah. Part of, so. The weapons may be made out of foam, but the weather doesn't make it any easier. It's pretty hot, and it's definitely a cardio workout. For ABC 10 UP, I'm Jacob Darner. Back to you guys.